Good morning guys, welcome to moving vlog day two. So we are in my bedroom. It's a little bit more set up. You can see it a little bit more in the daylight. I got a little bit more ready for today, but not much. It is 7.45 a.m. and mom was already up, so she ran to Target and gonna pick up bagels for everyone on the way back, which is so sweet. But while she's gone, I thought I would try to organize my office stuff here um, into this cart because it's gonna go next to my desk. So even though I don't have a desk yet, just like get that unboxed and organized. And then I actually have to do some homework for classes on Monday. So I thought while Lucy and her mom were sleeping, I could maybe get that done as well since obviously that won't make a lot of noise. So it's coming together. We definitely need a few more things today. Like I think I mentioned yesterday, I want a dresser um, to probably put in my room and to put this mirror on top of. And the thing is, I have so much other stuff at home, like um, a little bookcase and cubbies that I could be using. Didn't know how much room we would have and also ruin the cars. Um, we were pretty packed yesterday, but it's just like, I usually overpack to college, but this year I underpacked. Like I could have brought a lot more, but I love this setup. I love how my bed looks with a few other blue throw pillows. It'll be great. Um, I need something to, I need your guys' help because I we need a lot of art. And I know there's stuff from Society6, but if you guys know any other place for like decor stuff, I need something here to cover this gray piece. I could put like a full length mirror there eventually when I get that back from my house. That's another thing that... In a month I may get um and then but also I don't want to like open the door and hit the mirrors but I need something to cover that like something in this corner and then I don't know if I'd put my dresser like there or there or maybe on this wall or if my desk's gonna go on this wall we'll kind of see but yeah that's the overview of the room I thought I was recording this montage but I wasn't oh. Mom just got back from Target and had breakfast. Um, we got more black velvet hangers and then this shower curtain. And then, so I need to put that up. And then I'm really excited for this. She got, this was like almost sold out. She found this threshold stackable drawer. We are now making a stop at the dumpster while they're unloading everything. And we're gonna head to two antique stores um, to try and see if we can find any outdoor furniture or I can find a dresser maybe. We'll, we'll see, or decor, that's what we're looking at.
So no look at the antique stores, but we did get this shower um, liner to go with the curtain at TJ Maxx. So I only saw that you could put this in the kitchen. And then these two organizers, one for vitamins and medicine in the kitchen. And then this one, let's see, did we see if it fits well here? Yeah, it works well. It's the perfect length for there, so I'll probably put that on like a top shelf and fill it with something. We'll see what. We also got this pillow, which I think matches perfectly. It may actually even have been gone with the throw at TJ Maxx, so yes, feeling good about that. A little update, I decided to hang two of these like metal command strips to put necklaces and jewelry on just until I find, I think I'm gonna find a cute little jewelry organizer and put it over here to kind of have on display. Then, I wanna show you guys our plant. Put our flowers, gorgeous flowers on the coffee table. And then we went to Home Depot real quick and picked up this little guy. We need a name if you guys wanna help name it, but just this little plant right here was like $25. And people are out by the pool outside. What was that beeping? I don't know, but we're gonna close this. Right, so mom has left. She has gone home, which is always very sad. Um, gonna miss her. I don't know when I'll see her next, but hopefully soon. But anyway, before she left, we did find that a Target about 20 minutes from here had a dresser in like a dark brown black color that would match and also two bar stools that we liked so I went ahead and ordered that and they just told me it's ready for pickup I'm just gonna drive up they'll put it in my car and then I drive back so I'll have a good little like 40 50 minute drive right now um, so I'm gonna take a snack with me Lucy and her mom I think are coming back from a different target but I'm excited to um, have that dresser set up because I just think my room needs like one other piece obviously besides the desk too once we get that situation figured out but just have more drawer space and something to put like my mirror on all of that will be very nice uh, once mom left I did do some homework and I packaged up some orders I also have to stop by the post office but I'm feeling a little bit better like had some coffee sat down did some computer work I was stressing about and now we're ready to move forward I am so excited we got the stools we got the dresser yes feels good okay I had to help him load it in but glad we got it now I don't know we're gonna have to, I'm gonna need some help bringing them into the apartment for sure all right we got one chair in that's all I could haul by myself we have put together so many pieces of furniture in the past 24 hours well wow, living alone would really suck up the first one and I just ate here and ate my Panera here's like the little piece of bread I got the green goddess salad well mom actually picked it up this morning which was so kind of her and I was like yes I'm gonna eat that for dinner and it was so comfortable to sit in so very sturdy I highly recommend they were a little bit pricey but you know I'm figuring at this point like the furniture that I'm buying now I will be using for all the years coming up, which I will be living in an apartment. Um, hopefully no more dorm life for me. So, you know what? Thank you, mom, for helping me purchase some of this furniture. As I'm learning, like furnishing an apartment is so freaking expensive and we're even shopping at literally discounts. Like there's no West Elm Pottery Barn. Like the only stuff I have that is stuff from my old house, like that my parents have bought again, very thankful, but um, like my bed frames, Walmart, this coffee table I got at Target. Okay, we just got back from Trader Joe's and did an initial stock and got a lot of 
a lot of stuff. So now we are going to try to organize all of this. But feeling good to have a stock kitchen now. Yeah, we both have been stuck in our apartments for two months too long We don't even get along, but the world just fell apart uh, Straight out of the blue, so in my mind I whisper ciao And I take myself to Tuscany, Italy Riding on a Vespa in a sunflower field, yeah Warm wind blowing and birds are singing in cypress trees Tuscany, Italy Eating carbonara and reading my kid while the world ends, that's where I will be Go back to my room I pick up the laptop to join a work call I don't think Karen knows that she's wearing her sweatshirt inside out Oh, water on my plants And I, I just might I take a painting Read every book, then I learn to cook from videos and that Oh yeah, we all have been stuck in our apartments for two months too long We don't even get along, but the world just fell apart uh, Straight out of the blue, so in my mind I was So we moved the nightstand to this side because Lisa's mom is being amazing at helping me set up the black dresser on this side of the wall where I'm going to put the mirror on top of. So this is like the new, new setup here. And I don't know where I'm going to put my little desk. We may put this by the couch once that comes in, but we'll kind of see. But yes, I'm so excited for this dresser to be here. I've done a lot today. We went to Target and I didn't get any home good stuff. I just got like new shampoo, conditioner, moisturizer, dry shampoo, and mascara and vitamins. Um, and then we went to Trader Joe's. You guys saw that. Us unloading everything feels good to have some food. I'm here now at the apartment by myself. Lucy and her mom ran some more errands, but Lucy's mom was amazing and put together my dresser and it's done. And I put the mirror on top of it and it may be one of my new favorite parts of the whole place. Are you guys ready for this? I don't think you are. <laughs> Here it is. I love how it looks. So it was, I was so surprised yesterday we could get this dresser. Um, it was in stock. It's in an espresso shade. I'll link it below. Um, I think it was around $120, $120. But took a lot to put together. I'm thankful she did that. But it looks great. The drawers are super nice. You just pull like this. This top drawer, I don't know what I want to put in here yet. This one I put in bras and underwear and swimsuits. This one has all my workout clothes. We got shorts, tops, uh, what's that? Oh, sports bras, tops, shorts, and leggings. And then I don't have anything in the bottom. I may have to rearrange that. That's kind of tight. I don't have anything in the bottom yet. So I have some open drawers that I'm very excited for. And then up here, I'm working on decorating it. I put my mirror sideways. Lengthwise, it just was very tall and so I'm trying to get used to seeing how it looks sideways let me know what you guys think if I should switch it or leave it like this um, but I think it looks so great and then I just have my coffee table book I need to grab more of these from home because they just look so nice my candle votives I need to order some candles I just ordered from H&M home a little jewelry box a gold jewelry box that I will put all of the rest of my jewelry in and have here that'll be like a dainty little piece I think will be very pretty and then I don't know what else I may play around maybe add a candle here right now that could be nice but I'm so excited for this. I think it looks great. And then in here, what I decided to do with the, here, let me turn on a light. With the organizer that mom bought me yesterday, I decided this is going to be my little shipping area now in my um, closet. So I have like my stickers up here at the top, some shipping stuff I need to get more. And then we got workbooks and then stickers and other packaging stuff. And then my tissue paper is here. So this is my little packaging section um and here is what the closet's looking like i don't know what you guys have seen last but actually i'm gonna put on a sweatshirt i'm kind of cold already did some editing i may just do a little bit more organizing and i do need to figure out what to put on the walls still the walls are very blank 
my desk situation. We'll figure out when that comes. I'll probably, since I have so much over on here, um, I will may put my desk up against the wall or in that corner. That's how it's looking. I'm getting really, really happy with it, honestly. I like how t I have two candle things here, but then like another candle. I also want a vase, a vase with some flowers. There we go. I like it. What's up guys? It is Friday and I'm editing this video and didn't end it. So just wanted to say thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed all of these moving vlogs and packing vlogs. I will link the playlist below so if you missed one you can catch up. But now we are officially done with the moving vlogs. I want to do week in my life, some morning routine here, online school tips. Like tell me what you guys want but I'm very excited to start filming again. I took this week off from doing a week in my life because I was just overwhelmed with the footage I had from moving and I just was honestly overwhelmed with school. But we will discuss all of that. We have some exciting things um, that are switching up the schedule, but we will talk about all that in an upcoming video, but just wanted to say thank you for watching, and I hope you have a great day. Bye!